Hello everyone, welcome to Lakewood Chevrolet. My name is Kayla. Today we're going to do a walk around on this 2011 Chevrolet Avalanche. This is the four door crew cab in black. Under the hood is a 5.3 liter V8 engine coupled with a six speed automatic transmission. At the front end, you do have your daytime running lights, fog lights down below the blacked out Chevy bow tie emblem as well. But then coming down the side, you will be riding on top of Goodyear mud and snow tires with the alloy wheel. You have the running boards down below to help you into your truck with ease. And then also at the very back, your windows are tinted for your back passengers to have privacy. It also protects the upholstery from the sun as well. So now we've seen a little bit of the front or sorry the outside of this avalanche stick with me let's check out a few features in the front sitting in the front seat of the avalanche on the very comfortable leather seats i'll quickly show you by showing the passenger side here your driver's seat is power operated but let's take a closer look at these kilometers so here we have 157,795 kilometers and then on your leather wrapped steering wheel, you do have your cruise control. You also have your voice activated Bluetooth as well as your steering wheel audio control. So great safety features. You can concentrate on the road while talking or listening to your music. Uh, to the far, far left though, I wanna point out that you do have that uh, auto four by four, but then also the wonderful heated seats that you get to enjoy in the winter time for both you and your passenger. Moving over though to your stereo system here. So you do have, uh, your vehicle option buttons to the left hand side there's all your audio controls and under that is your dual zone climate control so you and your passenger can have two temperatures set at the same time uh, you won't have to fight over who's too hot or too cold pedal adjusters there you can turn on and on your uh, parking sensors out in the back there and you got your power outlets and in your center console quickly checking out very very deep center console you do have that usb port in there a lot of wood grain accent as you can see all throughout the interior of the avalanche and your glove box does lock so if you need to store some valuables in there you can do so not have to worry about them you also have the OnStar buttons on your rear view mirror so if you want to subscribe to OnStar you can do so great for roadside assistance and then up above you also get to enjoy that wonderful some roof in the summertime so now that we've seen a little bit of the front of this avalanche stick with me let's quickly check out the back Stepping into the back of the Avalanche, a lot of leg space for your passengers because of the crew cab, map holders in the back of each seat. And then in the center here, they have their own um, buttons that they can play around with when it comes to like music and all that kind of stuff. Power outlet down below. You also have the cup holders as well. And then the two side passengers have their armrests and cup holders there. And then also if you want to fold down these seats there's a handle that's just there in the center of the seat so you're going to pull the, that up all right and then the back of the seat does fold down as well you can access your trunks or your box with unlocking this and the whole thing comes down and opens up and same with the rear view window too so a lot of cool things with this avalanche now that we've seen the back let's go around and get a view of the rest of the truck so I'm going to start off with showing you that uh, on the side here, right on the back of your box, you do have these little storage compartments. All right, so you can store some stuff in there. The tunnel cover at the top, of course, to protect anything in your box from the harsh weather conditions like this wonderful snow here. Rear bumper sensors, like I'd mentioned earlier, and then you also have the backup camera, which is located right underneath that lift uh, gate hand or that tailgate handle. You do have this rubber mat in here to protect your box. All right, now let's go around to get the full view. It's in wonderful shape. We did just view the back seat. So we're gonna take a sneak peek of the front passenger side. I don't believe I told you guys what trim this is. It is the Avalanche LT. Door storage on each door with extra cup holders, a lot of leg space for your front passenger and their seat is power operated as well. So now I'd like to thank you for watching my video on this 2000 and 10 Chevrolet Avalanche LT. If you have any further questions, want to take it for a test drive or simply take it home, visit us here at Lakewood Chevrolet. We're on the corner of 91st Street and 34th Ave. Hope to see you soon. Have a wonderful day.